function or not function? Today we're going to try to identify functions from a different type of representations, tables, graphs, and set of points. So we need to remember the definition of a function is that every x value or input can be paired with only one value or output. So we're going to start with our first uh, table. We have, we notice that we have x values of 4, negative 2, 0, 2, and 4. And right away we notice that we have the value of x4 twice. So the first time, the value of x4, it's paired with that y of 16. And second, we have the same x value 4 paired with a negative 8. So the same x value is giving you different y values. It's paired with different y values. So this will be a non-function. Now let's look at our second graph. Sorry, table. In our second table, we notice that we have x values of negative 3, negative 2, 0, 2, and 3. None of my x values are repeated, so the possibility of the same x value being paired with different y values does not exist. So this is a function. Now, when it comes to a table, sorry, to a graph, what we need to focus on is in a vertical line. The way we're going to test this is imagining vertical lines that are going to pass through your graph. And the idea is that if they're only pair, every x value is paired only to one y value, your vertical line will only touch your line once every time. So every single one of my vertical lines here is, not, is touching the line only once. So for that, that will be a function. Now in my second graph, if I imagine a vertical line, and this time I will make it look like the y-axis, you will notice that that line will touch the, your graph in several points more than once. That will indicate that the same x values pair with different y values. That will make it a non-function. Now when we're looking about a set of points, we are going to do something similar that in the tables. We're going to focus on our x values. So in my first set of points, I noticed that my x values are 2, 4, 7, 9, and 10. None of them are repeated, so the possibility of the same x value being paired with different y values doesn't exist. There was, this will be a function. Now in my second one, in my second set of points, I notice that my y values, sorry, x values are 12, 15, 16, 19. None of them repeated. The possibility of the same x value being paired with different y values does not exist. So this is a function. When we look at our third set of points, let's look at our x values. 2, 4, 7, 7, and 10. Right away you notice that you have the value of x7 twice. First pair with the 3, then pair with an 8. That will make it a non-function. At last, in our fourth example, I want you to notice that we have x values of 10, 15, 19, and 19. Again, we have a repeated x value, so our focus is going to go straight there. The number 19 for x is paired first with the 1, then with the 5. Same x value, different y values. That will make it a non-function. I hope that you found this helpful and you liked it.